Vacation. Hey, welcome back, everyone, for some more, for some more Go Vacation. Sorry about that stammering there. It's been a while since I played this game. But we are going to go ahead. Not only are we going to play this game here in the month of June, but we're also going to be playing it here on Sundays in the month of July as well. So we got two months worth of Go Vacation to play here, and uh, we're going to be doing more orienteering tasks. But before we get into things, it's a... Uh, this, uh, it's, uh, before we get into anything here in this episode, which, wow, I have, I'm having a nightmare speaking English. Hope you guys have an, uh, an awesome day today. Hope you guys are doing well. So we're going to go ahead and go to City Resort during the day. Yeah, sorry about that awful intro, everyone. Yeah, I don't know why I'm stammering this much, but... But yeah, on Sundays in June and July, we're going to be playing this game. So I hope you guys are looking forward to it. I'm not sure how many episodes, or should I say, I'm not sure how many Sundays are in June and July altogether. But I'm going to say at least eight, possibly nine, that we'll be doing here. It's always a fun time coming back to this game. Welcome to the City Resort. The orienteering info has been updated. Here are the latest details. Power Boxer, they want us to break the machine. That's plus 200. Mountain Resort, they want us to find the Bell of Happiness, which is another 2,000. And then Marine Bike Corps, 140 point trick combo. Which I don't think I've ever done that, but I'm going to try here towards the end of the episode. But we are going to go ahead and we're going to go to Power Boxer first. Which we're gonna go this way. I could actually warp here, but what's the fun in that? Yeah, we need to go towards the tent area. Here we go. So we're just gonna skate all the way over to this person. Come on, come on. Sure, sure. Are you one of my loyal followers? <laughs> no need to be shy. I can't help but attract a fan base wherever I go. If you want to learn how to throw punches as beautiful as mine, then you gotta play with the power boxer. You can work your body while having fun. What could be better? Punch with all you've got and shrug off the stresses of the day. Let's see what punches you've got. To the east lies Kawari Memorial Park. Okay, let's see the controls. We go out on our left and right to restore power. Oh. No. And then shake the controller to punch. Wait until the timing circle is at its smallest to pack the heftiest punch. We'll do level one. There we go! We did it! And that's a new high score! Ultimate weight. There we go! And then that's middleweight. I, I don't care. I already broke the machine. I don't- I don't care. We can be done with this. I'm sorry if you hear my dogs in the background again. Break the machine, plus 2,000. I wonder how far we are to the next level. 
which I'm not sure if I've said this or not in the series. I think I have, but I think the final episode of the series is whenever I reach level 99 on my player. And then I'll be calling it quits from here. If you're connected to the internet, you never know what might show up raring to challenge you. Wow, your punches were only powerful, but clean and fast, too. You really got the perfect punch. I don't know what else to say, but way to go. Your punches just set a new record. Come back and show me some more of your killer punches. <laughs> That's one of those games I don't like because it always feels like I'm going to break my analog stick. And I've already had several controllers in the past that's had left analog stick issues. Oh, hey there, lion. Okay, there we go. I was wondering where that thing was. But we're actually going to be going back to Yggdrasil Central Tower. Or at least I'm going to try. Oh, it's right here. And then we're just going to go up here. Okay, here we go. It seems like I'm always going everywhere but where I need to go. But we are actually going to be going to the mountain resort. We're going to go ahead and try to find the bell. We'll be going during the daytime here as well. Why not? With four separate resorts in the villa grounds, you always find something to do on Kauai Island. And that's, what, that's one of the reasons why this is one of my favorite games. is because there's no shortage of something. If you can't find something here that you like in this game. You're not even trying. But as you can see, we're going to Mountain Resort. We see Shanghai Castle, Odie McRae Falls, and then we got Longhorn Ranch, which I really have not discovered that area much. And we got Shanghai Ridge. That's where the bungee jumping is. And you see Tonga Blanca in the background, but that's technically part of the snow resort. Okay, we already broke the machine at Power Box, so now we're going to be finding the Bell of Happiness. And then after this, we're going to be trying the 140 point trick. Oh, hey there, Epic X. Playing Clubhouse Games. That, now that's a game I have not played in a while. Wait a minute. We're, we're no, I don't want... I don't know why the default is the horse. I don't want horse. The horse gets stupid a lot of times, in my opinion. Now the bell should be easy to find, considering that I found it many times in the past. Well, help if I learn how to drive. Okay, what? Let's go ahead, let's go up here. And it should be up here where the Bell of Happiness is. It should be up in this area. I'm just gonna go up here. Oh, it's it's over there. Okay. The bell is right up there. Let's go ahead and get out. Should be around here. Actually kind of took the long way to get here, but same difference. Mm 
And that is the Bell of Happiness. How far are we to... Okay, we're, we're not even halfway to 95 yet, so... But we're going to go back in our car. Yeah, this is probably end up going to be a shorter episode. But I'm going to say... Well, depending on how long it takes me to get... And even then, I'm only going to try like 10 to 15 minutes to try to get the... Orienteering task done for that. Because I'm not spending a whole lot of time trying to get a 140 point combo trick trying to do it on a marine bike. Why does it seem like the more I drive this thing, the less control I have? Oh, okay, I do want that balloon. It seems like the more I drive this off-road car, the less control I have with it. I don't know why that's... I, I, maybe it's just me, I don't know, but... Let's cut through here. And we're going to go back to the um, information center. It only took us not even 10 minutes to get these two orienteering tasks done. Oh, why did you turn? Idiot. If I would have hit that horse, that would have been their fault. I'm sorry. Yeah, why would you turn when there's oncoming traffic like that? What, do you have a death switch? Ah, oh, that was stupid. That was absolutely dumb. From the sand bank at Rocky Ridge Cove, go past the sharks and check out the small sand cloud. And I'm just going to go ahead and take a drink of my coffee here real quick. Yeah, I'm only going to attempt this for like 10 minutes. I not, really don't want to waste a whole long, lot of time trying to pull this off. Okay, this should be a marine bike. This should be marine bikes accessible here. Somewhere. That was one of those crabs. Where the heck? Okay, let's jump off. There's got to be marine bikes accessible somewhere. Okay. We got one right here. There we go. There we go. Okay, that's... How am I supposed to do this? Oops. Let's go ahead and do this.
Okay, I'm supposed to be doing a hundred and... Okay, let's see if I can do... Like I said, I'm only gonna try this for like ten or so minutes. There we go! Okay! I pulled it off! Awesome! I don't think I've ever done that before. Okay, I need to find where I can park this. I guess I'll just do... Okay, I'll just put it there. I guess I gotta swim. No, how, how am I supposed to get... How, how am I supposed to get back on the dock? No kidding, no kidding what? Excuse me. There has to be a way you can get back, unless we go to the beach, which I might end up going to the beach. Because I don't know how you're supposed to get in... Yeah, I don't know how you're supposed to get back on the dock from... From here. There's, like, really nowhere you're supposed to... There's really nowhere you can go. Yeah, we'll just do that. We'll just park it there. But yeah, this is one of the shorter episodes in the series, but there really is nothing else for us to do here. Because we have already done the 140 point trick. So where does that put us? We're just under 660 thousand points. We're still not halfway to 95 yet. Well, we just gotta go back to the information center. Well... And we're going to call it an episode. That wasn't too bad. I don't really care about the gift right now, if I'm being honest. That person is frustrated. But here we go. We're going to go ahead and stop here. Next time I see you guys, we will be starting things off in the snow resort. So hopefully you guys are looking forward to that. We'll be doing some more routine tasks. But thank you guys so much for watching this. Hope you guys are enjoying the series so far. I'll be seeing you guys again next time.